Today is Ashura Dial. Today is the day of the tenth of Muharram. Yazid's men blew the trumpets to start the battle. The battle began. One by one, Hussein's friends and companions went to the battlefield and gave their lives for Islam. By Zur time, all the friends and companions were martyred. Since dawn, Imam Hussein had carried 72 bodies to the camp. Hussein was thirsty, tired, heartbroken, but he kept on. Patience was his prayer, and sacrifice to save Islam was his goal. All Hussein was worried about was saving Islam. By ASR time, Hussein was left son, Sayyid al-Sajjad, Imam Zainul Abidin, who was ill. Our poor Imam inflicted with so much suffering in just one day. So many dead in one day. Hussein is all alone, thirsty, tired, and heartbroken. He stood in the center of the camp and cried out, My salam to you, O Zainab, O Um Kulthum. My salam to you, O Rukaya, O Kubra, O Sakina. My salam to you, O Rubab, O Laila, O Um Farwa, O Amafiza. Fi Aman Allah, Fi Aman Allah. Tears flowed from Hussein's eyes as he spoke about Sakina. Sister Zainab, be patient. Patience, my sister, patience, my sister Zainab, fi aman Allah. Zuljana moved a few steps and stopped. Hussein gently stroked the horse's neck and said, My faithful horse, I know you are thirsty, I know you are tired. My faithful horse, for the last time, take me to the battlefield. I will not bother you after that. Please, Zuljana, let us go. With tears in his eyes, the horse turned his neck and looked down at his legs. Hussein saw his beloved daughter Sakina clinging to the horse's legs. Sakina, only four years old. Sakina, the answer to Hussein's prayers for a daughter. Sakina, who loved Hussein like Bibi Fatima loved Hussein. Sakina, the delight of Hussein's heart. Little Sakina was crying and saying, O oh horse, do not take my father away. No horse, no. You will not bring my father back. Since dawn, everyone who has gone to the battlefield has not come back. Please, horse, do not take my father away. I will not be able to live without my father. Please, horse, please. Hussein loved Sakina very much. Hussein got off his horse. My darling Sakina, do not cry, my love. Did you not give me permission to go? Sakina, go, my darling, go. Go and recite do us with your auntie and mother. Your grandmother is waiting for me. Hussein laid down on the sands of Karbala. Little Sakina put her head on her father's chest. After a few seconds, Sakina got up and said, Go, father, go, fi aman Allah, father. Hussein was not a coward. He was brave and strong. Hussein was the son of Ali. Hussein fought the battle with his greatest might. One by one, Hussein killed the best warriors of Yazid. The enemy were pushed back by the mighty Hussein. Our great imam fought like a lion. He was the best. No one dared come near our imam. Imam Hussein reached the banks of River Farat. He saw Abbas lying there. At that moment, Angel Jibrael appeared in the sky and said, O oh Hussein, Allah is very pleased with your bravery. Hussein, the time has come to put your sword down. Enough, Hussein, enough. Come to us, Hussein, we are waiting for you. Hussein heard Allah's command. He put his sword down. The enemies saw Hussein put his sword down. They attacked our imam from all sides. Arrows were shot at Hussein. Hussein was attacked with swords. People who did not have arrows or swords threw stones at Hussein. Allahu Akbar, our poor imam, with a thousand wounds, bleeding, blood gushing out of the wounds. Hussein could not stay on his horse. He fell from his horse. My fellow Husseini, our imam is covered with arrows. Shimmer, the most evil of Yazid's men, walked to Imam Hussein. He had a big dagger in his hand. Imam made a request to him. Oh, Shimmer, I know your intention. I beg of you to give me a little time to do two sajda. Hussein did the first sajda on the musala of arrows. Oh, Allah, all praise is to you and you alone. Hussein lifted his head and went down to perform his second sajda. Shimur did not let Imam Hussein lift his head from this last sajda. The earth trembled. The sky turned black. Jibrael cried out, Hussein has been killed in Karbala. Hussein has been killed in Karbala. Bibi Zainab saw her brother's head on a lance. She cried out, Inna lillahi wa inna ilai raja'un.